My name is Stephen Waddell, and I graduated uh, with a Bachelor's of Arts in 1975 and a doctorate in education in 1996. My name is Sarah Michelson, and I graduated in 2005 with a Bachelor of Science in Fashion Merchandising, and I'm currently a first grade teacher working in Washington. You can't talk about us without talking about my great-grandfather was a uh, sharecropper. He, he worked hard, and my grandmother did too. For some reason, they felt like they wanted their sons, their four sons, to have a college education. So dad uh, was a pioneer, you know, the first uh, in our family to ever get a college degree, uh, the first to get a master's degree, the first to get a doctorate. Distinguished himself as an educator and uh, passed a great legacy on to us. Dad was going to start his doctorate degree, and uh, that wasn't going to be easy for the family. It was pretty much understood I was going to go to school here, too. I ended up just falling in love with the school. It felt like a larger school, but not too large. Everyone that I met was just very welcoming, and that's kind of a big goal of mine as a teacher, is just making my kids feel welcomed at school. And that's something that's very important to me as a, as a teacher, and it's just those those relationships that I build with my, my kids. When you form relationships with people, they're gonna work harder and they're gonna learn more. And it's not because they're made to do it, it's because they now feel like they're owning that. They then become innovators themselves in the work. Uh, it becomes a collective thing. When you talk about a visionary, nobody is a visionary like him. And what people don't know about him is that he has changed the landscape of public schools in Texas and beyond. In establishing the scholarship, four school leaders wanted to focus on those who would be innovative. To me, an innovative leader is someone who empowers. Those kinds of leaders need to be those who empower everyone and turn them into leaders, uh, engaging both staff and students and the community in the work that needs to be done. It's all around the learning of the students. That's what it's all about.